Good afternoon, everybody. Get ready to make some kale and white beans, okay? Right here, I have um, the kale and a little piece of um, bacon in. Okay, get ready to dice up some um, bell peppers in there, okay? So I have this little yellow, I mean orange bell pepper right here. Okay. Put that up in the skillet. I have this can of uh, white beans. I'm gonna put that in the skillet with a cup of water. I fill this can back up with water and I'm gonna pour it on the inside of here. Okay. Now get rid of that, put that in the trash. I've already washed my kale, okay? So let me bring my kale over here so you guys can see it. I got the kale here. I'm gonna dice it up. I took most of the sticks out of it already prior to um, turning on the camera. I was getting rid of the sticks, you know, like how you got the sticks and the greens to this part. A lot of it out of the kale, I get got rid of it. Okay. This may look like a whole bunch of kale, but once it cooks down like spinach or greens, it's not that much. Okay. So, like I said, I washed the kale. Now I'll just start chopping. Okay. And this is just one bunch of kale. One little bunch. I'm going to rinse it again. Got my knife here. Dice the kale up. Okay. Put that up in there with the beans. Put that up in there. I could have waited was to put the kale in and let the beans do its thing. But uh, white, these white beans in this can cook really quick. So actually, I'm going to leave this on for like an hour. Put the kale up in there. That kale up in there. some white rice going too. So next, I'm going to put some chicken bouillon. I'm going to put some cumin in here. Move that kale over. Really want to get it on top of the beans. Okay, got some kale in there. I mean, um, cumin. Use this chicken bouillon. You can use whatever kind you want. I like this flavor right here. Get a little black pepper. If I had like 
like chicken broth or something like that or beer, I'll probably put some of that up in here. Okay, I'm gonna lower my fire. Put my onions, I put my bell pepper, I'm gonna put my garlic in here. I was seeing if I had a little bit more of that uh, cream of mushroom, not too, but put a little bit more water. Um, oh, I'm going to put a pepper in there. I'm going to put a serrano chili in there just for flavor. I'm not going to bust it. I got a serrano chili. The one serrano chili in there. Just some more herbs, just a little Mediterranean herbs. Okay. Put a little curry powder in there. A little coconut milk. Once it thaw out. Once it's done, I'm going to put a little bit of that coconut cream in there. Not a lot, just a little drop for flavor. Okay, I got a couple of um, plugs of garlic here. Oh, bought some garlic yesterday. These are some tiny little garlics. I'm used to the big, I like big um, plugs of garlic. Okay, so we got three little plugs right here. Rated that up in here. Okay. Three plugs of garlic. Just a little bit of white salt. A little garlic powder. This is the coconut milk. Okay, it was frozen, so I'm just going to put a little block of coconut cream in there. Okay, so now that's it for the kale. Yeah. Mmm, got good flavor. All right. Now, I'm going to leave that for an hour. Put it on the timer. One hour. I'll come back to that. All right, so now you guys know, um, have an idea how to make some um, kale and white beans, okay? And you guys know the, um, the flavor that I'm going to ask you. If you've been here before, thanks for coming to my channel. I appreciate you. If this is your first time, welcome to the channel. And please, 
If you like it, hit like and subscribe and share and come back again, okay? And God bless you and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.